Hello and welcome to another episode. I'm Ryan Chan, CEO and founder of Upkeep. In this episode, we provide insights into successful maintenance and reliability strategies. We're thrilled to have Luane Smith, the head of asset management and reliability at the University of Kansas Medical Center, sharing his transformative journey of a preventative maintenance program. Stay with us as we dive into Luane's approach, his use of the uptime elements, and his vision for the future of the maintenance industry. Luane, a recent recipient of our Up and Comer in the Maintenance and Reliability Award, tells us how he got started in the industry. He credits a chance meeting with Paul Crocker, who introduced him to the Uptime Elements, a framework that links all aspects of maintenance and reliability, sparking his interest in the field. In his role, Lewayne has made a significant impact at the University of Kansas Medical Center in just over a year. He takes pride in the shift in thinking about managing assets within his organization. He emphasizes the importance of understanding that changing strategies can lead to extracting more value from assets. When Lewayne first joined, the maintenance reliability program was almost non-existent. The focus was on revitalizing the preventative maintenance program. However, after discovering the uptime elements and understanding the broader picture, he set a five-year goal for the organization and worked backward to create a plan to achieve it. Luane credits his military background for instilling in him the discipline to be detailed, which he believes is crucial for success in the maintenance and reliability community. He also brought his knowledge of work order management and work execution management from his military experience to his current role. What keeps Luane passionate about the industry is the changes he sees happening within his organization. He is excited about the shift in mindset where upper management is recognizing the value that can be created from assets by implementing certain strategies. However, changing perceptions and implementing new strategies were not without challenges. Lewayne had to identify immediate changes that could make a significant impact and get people to buy into what they were doing. He focused on achieving quick wins, which helped gain the support of others. One of the first quick wins was the adoption of a criticality analysis of all assets. This process helped the team understand the different priorities of assets and how to apply maintenance strategies accordingly. Looking into the future, Luane is excited by the emerging technologies in the maintenance and reliability industry. He believes that these technologies can attract the younger generation to the industry and help them understand how it interconnects with everything else in life. For those wanting to get into the industry, Luane advises them to slow down, think about where they want to be, and formulate a plan on how to get there in small chunks. He emphasizes that it's not a project, but a journey of continuous improvement. Luane also sees plenty of career advancement opportunities in the industry. He believes that understanding how to create value in physical assets can open doors to various positions within an organization, possibly even to the role of a chief financial officer. Luane is currently preparing to take the Certified Maintenance and Reliability Professional, or CMRP, exam. He believes that this certification will add value to him as a professional and make people listen more to what he has to say about maintenance and reliability. Lastly, Luane emphasizes the importance of culture in driving change within an organization. He believes in the power of champions who can influence others and bring about change. He also stresses the importance of setting a common goal for the team to drive the culture of maintenance and reliability. And that brings us to the end of this episode. We want to thank you for tuning in. We hope you've gained valuable insights from Luane Smith's transformative journey and his approach to maintenance and reliability. Remember, it's not just about strategies, but also about culture, discipline, and continuous improvement. If you enjoyed this episode, please subscribe to our channel for more insights. To learn more about how Upkeep can help your maintenance and reliability teams, visit us at upkeep.com. Thanks again for watching, and we look forward to bringing you more content in the future.